What's up guys, welcome back to Marshall Disc Golf. Um, today I'm going to be giving you guys a little preview of four brand new discs I got. Um, I've thrown one of them many times and the other ones I've just picked up, just going to start throwing. They're pretty cool. So the one that I've thrown a lot of is an ESP Buzz SS. Um, the flight numbers on that are 5, 4, negative 2, 1, and 0. And this disc is crazy, man. This is taking the place of one of my older buzzes I had in my bag. Um, I just didn't, it wasn't flying the way I liked it, so I bought a brand new one. Really digging the colors on it. It's kind of got this green. You can really see it on the back. It's got that green. It flies straight for me with a sight finish at the end and I'm really loving it um, definitely check these out this one is 174 so I like throwing a little heavier so that's that <clears throat> and then these three are the newest ones that I have we'll start off with this guy Paul Macbeth Zeus um, again max weight um, the flight numbers are 12, 5, negative 1, 3, and 1.9. Um, I've already thrown this a couple of times. It's got some scuffs, but this is a bomb disc. It's got that cool gold foil in the stamp. Um, to me, it feels it feels a lot like, I have to say, a lot like my Thrasher that's beat in. Um, not super deep, not super shallow. Um, really comfortable in the hand. I really love this. I really love it for backhands. Um, I can really rip on it straight and it'll hold it for just long enough to get around certain trees. Um, but I'm really digging this disc. It's going to take, it's definitely taking one of my overstable spots in my bag. I really like it. I've thrown it for one round and uh, that's the Paul Macbeth Zeus. Definitely try that out too. Next, ESP Zone. This disc. I am I'm, I'm in love with it. I've already ordered two more. Um, flight numbers are four, three, zero, three, and two point zero. Um, this has taken the place of my harp. Um, I've ordered, like I said, I've ordered two more. I have six harps, and right off the bat, the difference in this to the harp is comfort, feel of the plastic. Um, I. I still feel that I'm going to keep one harp in my bag. It's going to be my one forehand harp because I can make that go straight um, until I beat a zone in because this is overstable on my forehand right now. But oh, I love this disc. Great feeling. Um, definitely, if you guys are looking for an approach disc, I always recommend the harp and I'm definitely recommending the zone now. Um, beautiful disc, feels great, flies great. Um, threw it off a tee pad, throw it off tees, throw it at up shots forehand backhand it works amazing with everything definitely try those out it feels a little different than the harp I feel a little straighter my harp has a curve on it um, but yeah it's an amazing disc amazing disc next one one that I'm really excited about this is the brand new Paul Macbeth mid-range the Malta um, its flight numbers are five four one three and 1.9 and you can really rip on you can really rip on it the buzz it's just a little bigger I would say um, a little bigger in circular size this one has a little more dome this is flat you can kind of tell um, this has a bead this doesn't that's one of the other big differences but I love this disc I've uh, been ripping on this for more oh, when I need it to be a little more overstable than my buzz I've been grabbing this and I've been really ripping on it and it's been doing exactly what I want and uh, it's a really great disc I would definitely recommend it um, so amazing disc the Malta feels really good in the hands you can kind of grab that some people I've seen a buddy throw it with the finger up I throw it just like that kind of more of a power grip or I do a little fan grip when I throw and so yeah these are the four discs the Buzz SS really digging it 
the zone. Love this disc. Works great for overstable. I've thrown it on a spike hyzer over trees once. <clears throat> the Zeus. I can rip that baby out there. Get some distance. It's taking my max distance driver spot. Like I said. And then my personal favorite out of this group is the Malta. Um, this also looks really cool colors. It's got some extra little colors around the back. You can't really see them. They're a little dark. But it's a fantastic disc. Paul Macbeth did a amazing job designing this and so did Discraft putting it together and I'm really excited to see what if they make adjustments to it and to see the stamp that they're going to put on it. I'm really excited to see those and get my hands on some of those. So guys those are four discs I would definitely check out. out at, you can order them online. Um, I recommend Disc Store. They have wide variety, all companies, Prodigy, Legacy, Dynamic, they have Latitude, West Side, Gateway, Discraft, Innova, all those. They have all of them. And you can order them online. They also have these sweet hats. As you can tell, got a beanie that's over there. And they give out some cool, some minis. They have some minis. Um, after you buy so many, you can get a free disc. So I definitely recommend that. Um, order online. You, Use those guys, really good guys to work with, awesome. Also guys, don't forget, drop a like, subscribe. Use my code JMarshall10 for 10% off any purchase at DiscGolfSportswear.com. They have sweet shirts, some cool hats, they have women's, they have kids. We're working on hoodies, I've been designing hoodies, sending them out, we're kind of getting that work down. So I'm trying to figure out designs and get them sent in to see what those guys think about it and hopefully we will get those on the website soon as soon as I can get it all designed and worked out. So thank you guys for tuning in. Hope you enjoyed this little mini review of these four discs. And I hope to see you guys out on the course throwing some plastic.